Hello, my name is Pansella and welcome to my channel. On tonight's Real Housewives of Potomac, Mia spoke with her husband Gordon, letting him know that she's going to have a lunch date with her mom, which she thinks is a good thing. Wendy is back home. Her kids are excited to see her. And she sat down with Eddie and he was just dumbfounded at how people could accuse him of infidelity. Giselle uh, is getting ready for her podcast with Robin. Robin struggled to close her uh, patio door. And the subject of that podcast was about infidelity, which both have experienced. Robin uh, remember her infidelity that was brought on by in her early marriage as a young woman to one and Giselle is thinking about the infidelity that she's just gone through and they both think too much of themselves to go through that again. Now Chris is talking with his wife Candace and she's letting him know that she had uh, a dance off and she was looking for some backup dancers for her uh, latest video and She's kind of nervous, but she hopes everything goes well. Well, Ashley and her husband have gone to, uh, I think she's a masseuse, but she specializes, has specialization with children because Dylan is not taking a bottle and that's is causing Ashley to have, to feed him every hour on the hour and she wants an alternative some kind of way of getting him well without having to have some kind of surgery and she wonders if Michael still finds her attractive and he tells her that he doesn't see her being overweight whatsoever and he is still physically attracted to her. Um, Robin talking to her youngest son, Carter, realizing that she needs help. So she has reached out to a life coach and was speaking to the life coach because she has a 42nd birthday on the horizon and she has realized there's something that she needs to do a little bit better in her life. Mia takes her mom to a restaurant so they can talk and hash things out and she kind of wanted to know why she ended up being in foster care. Now, me and mother didn't want to tell her. She said she didn't want to go into it, but she decided to let her know, you know, it was your dad who actually got me hooked on drugs because he also was hooked. And me was thinking, I can only remember things about, good things about my dad and think about that. But, um... She was glad to have lunch with her mom, and Mia and Wendy met up with Karen, who was trying on dresses, not her wedding dress, but the second dress that she plans to wear at her reception once she and Ray do that 25th renewal ceremony, and where she was actually trying on the dresses is going to be the venue where they're actually going to renew their vows. Um, there's a little slight argument between Chris and Candace because he's saying there, uh, he's not going to be able to make it to one of her or uh, two of her sessions because he has to do some cooking uh, shows. And why are you expecting so much out of me when I'm not getting paid? Um, then it comes time for the get together for um oh good gravy I can never remember this girl's name Giselle's friend Robin 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 so there is a party of six and Ashley was invited Karen nor Wendy were invited but. Ashley and Candace are going back and forth, bickering. Um, Candace was like, 
your big head um, came there, made mess, and like four hours later, you were gone.